Christ. And uh, this one's going to be a fun one. Early on, Sully, we're seeing a default on map two. Yeah, early on, it's going to be Sentinels that look to at least sell a fake to the A side. And I love this. Normally, the cue is that you see Shazam playing on that silver towards the A side. And look at the rotations. Tens has made that TP. I see why he's using Yoru now. And they have <laughs> sold the fake perfectly. They really have. And it's working out, Sully. Sick now from around the corner. Still has that boom button. They're going to be Woo! able to use it. Dizzy trying to run away. Oh. And it's Tens and Zoms combining at the exact same time for two very quick kills on site. Sonics, however, they still have Bob over towards that elbow side. Going to be able to get a quick one, but still Excited. not a lot of HP you, uh, back for Bob. For Bob has to wait up for his teammates to actually make their bits. way over. Watch out for Shazam, though. Shazam oh, might have gotten those. spotted by Ion, oh. and they still want to go for that 1v1. And Ion ends up winning. Both players now remaining over towards Long. It's a crossfire between Zoms and Tens. Tens going for that first peak. Not going to reveal where Zoms is whatsoever. This is actually a great spot for Zoms. Oh, Zoms my goodness, that one. Tens. Tens works out with a flash. Ion does get that kill back. 13 HP left on Zoms. Oh, Ion my God. So Ion close. needs to go for the wide swing, and now needs Holy. to go for the defuse. Which he has time to do so. NC wow, tie. okay. Uh, we went through quite a few heaps and bounds to make it to this point, Sully, but Sonic says the round. Yeah, a really huge opener from both sides. Sentinels, Daniela. you saw the idea to sell a fake to that A side. Today, the wall goes I'm up good. to I'm just the exit. Very Shazam and Tens make huge contact plays. And look at this. You just cannot punish that, right? Tens, you as soon as he feels any danger, as soon as his team has walked up long, he makes that TP. That is the effectiveness of Yoru. But again, Sonics, they did a really, really good retake here. And honestly, a little bit of luck from Ayan to find that kill. We're both really after. low HP. It's unfortunate that Zombs isn't there for the swing. But Sonics, similar to our first map, they pick up the pistol and they do so right after with a full buy. Wonderful, wonderful. And we have to go back into yet another round. It's a second round conversion that Sonics might be a little bit desperate to try to pick up because this B side is about to get crunched. Oh, Dizzy, caught up, and he is. Wow, Tens is able to punish. Sexy Big ass. crash not out just yet, but sick. Oh. A quick jump out. There's just too much focus on the Tens, and they're able to catch out Bob. She goes down and crunchy in the middle of Tim oh Can. Oh, my God. Nothing he can really do there. And that's the sense huh. we know and love. A quick crunch into the site, and they're going to take out the round here unless Flix can do something. Yeah, let me remind you here, so yes, it is a little bit more... Uh, oh, Dabber got killed the by the, the Sentinels, but the Rays in all reality, it was just a couple of digs. They are able to pick up Tyson's SMGs. The they are able to no, pretty Tyson's much make it into a light. bonus. As now Sonics oh. has nothing to work with no. going into this next round. Yes, that's correct. A tie scoreline between Sonics and Sentinels going into round number three. Fucking... And Sonics is off way worse than their opponents were. <laughs> He's on the final list right round. now. <laughs> they have nothing to work Sorry. with. Sorry. This, I feel like we say that. The reason why I said that Sentinels was because just did it on the, the mouse is right here. And I was looking at it. Right? Okay. I'll take it out I of sub only. I think utility is getting, you know, sacrificed too. I think this one's a little bit worse in all reality. Please be nice, chat. <laughs> Maybe, Seriously. potentially. The deagles could work. The sidearms are fun. Please, please, and please. early on, Sully, it's yet another default position where Sentinels are actually doing some pretty cheeky work over towards these back lines. An orb battle and a battle for short ends up laying around four bodies. Three bodies. Trade out two oh, for two. Sentinels. I don't know if they want to commit. Looks like they are. Yeah, fake Yoru steps into the truck. Where are the rotations here yet from Sonics? I think they're not fully sold on the fact that this is an A hand. I think that's due in part to Tens tossing out those fake footsteps. Now the rotations surely have to come in. Crunchy is up top. He's not really going to be able to find much as he's instantly nice, punished from Tens. Still has the gate crash now to use if he wants to go from a different angle. So now Sonics have to worry about that TP. Dizzy's at least going to be able to pick up a Spectre, but I don't think there's much they can really do. They have the lesser guns, and Shazam already spotting out the first. They know the second's in heaven, yeah. An unwinnable position here coming out from Sonics and Sentinels. They'll surely Whoa. have the second round. Hold on, pause, wait a minute. There's yeah. still a chance. <laughs> Thankfully, Shazam is there to clean things up nicely. Hold on, wait a minute. You thought they were finished? Dizzy is actually nice. going to be able to get another one, and Shazam is the last one alive. Sully, the Ooh. Investments, Ooh, at least scary. for uh, for Sentinels going a little bit more off to the wayside. Yeah, so I, I realized like mid sentence, I was like, I shouldn't say anything because I forgot Dizzy had a Spectre and he had a chance to maybe make there, a There was happen. something, yeah. Right, but <laughs> <laughs> it was close. It was close. And yeah, Tens was in this, so I was like, okay, wait a second. This, this is a little worrying, but Sentinels, you expected them to win that round. I think it was a little bit too close to their liking, but thankfully because they won that second round force buy, their economy is in a pretty strong position where they could still muster a strong buy. And Jazam will have a lot of credits left over. Really the only one punished is Tens, who has zero credits at the moment. 
unfortunately. But uh, it goes at the expense of this Sully. The dimensional drift finally going through tens. Oh, okay, bobbing and weaving through this B site, leaving everything out in disarray. He runs right oh. in the middle of everyone, TPs away, and has essentially dragged away all this pressure away from Hookah at the exact same time. Wow. Fiber Speed going up too. It's a plethora of util right in the middle of this B site, and it's an nice. absolute mob. Sick is still in that back line. Bob and Dizzy have left. Sentinels now have full control. Bob's still gonna be able to get another one, yet another Viper's Pitch, just to try to make their way in. Sick Curly at 1A HP has to run away, and it's a Venn diagram of Util here on site. What on earth is going on? The spike's still finally going down. Ian right in the middle, gonna be able to take down tens. Sick with another kill back. It's still uh -oh. a two on three, it's still a 1v3. Sonic's is uh, a Viper's Pit, there's gonna go down. Dapper is still alive, that Hunter Fury not hitting oh, him. Oh my that's god. Like half planted <laughs> in the middle of the sub. ground. I've never seen that, by the way. Uh, half planted. Got out for the sub. Oh, 30, 30, seconds well. 30 seconds left, though. Dapper playing ring and the rosy it is pure chaos sully but it is finally subsided i have the spike like dapper the where on. do you even run is he really Dude, gonna no make a way. mad dash into tp no surely not not enough time at this point maybe with 20 seconds he had an opportunity but he's gonna tap the spike oh my god so many oh, runs wow. coming out NC. from the back of ct spawn but dizzy they're just in the good time as dapper was looking for the headshot uh, Sentinels, GBL, quantum one gonna concede the second round of sonics and now the economy maybe becomes a little bit more worrisome. Tens was the worry. Is the volume still okay, you guys? The economy last round where he had zero credit, so he's not going to be able to get a drop here. And because he's not playing maybe Arena or Kay. or a Jet, he can't really use the knives. He can't really afford a sheriff here, and he could be punished very easily. Tens so sucks. It's Sentinels. That's okay. He'll still be better by than minus you. Tens so he's on a sheriff. But it is still, you know, it is still tens. All right, Sentinels guaranteed. No, they're it guaranteed is, for it champions. It is still tens on a sheriff who ends it's up okay. getting like everybody. I, I think he's still got like day. like six or seven kills just off of the sheriff. And, the line, and there it is. And there he gets another one. Of course, tens with a side angle, threading the needle, getting the first headshot, getting the entry duel. More importantly, just like that, Sonics has left a little bit more into that uh, in towards that back line. I and he's pinged, and he's finally gonna go down. That hunter's theory chases him nice. down, and Sentinels without stepping one bit into that a side has gotten themselves three kills now Shazam getting down Dizzy who was trying to run away Wow Sonics are just done for Sully this is uh this is a send round you gotta love the explosion from Sentinels as soon as Tense finds that first frag Shazam is quick to get the ult orb get it online and find a pick in the back site and it's a great util combination because Dapper tosses a snake bite into that back corner kind of restricting the movement wow nice that Ion could really move around that back site and there's no way you can dodge the hunt to three of your cornered in the back site so Sonic what is he doing seeding the round back to Sentinel oh, it's a back it? and forth a tug of war and Sonic's unfortunately this was not a strong round this just didn't even look like they were in the competition but they will save at least one one rifle, but it's just a consolation at this point in time. Sentinels three to two, and well, like we said, tens with the sheriff is just as deadly with anyone with a rifle. <laughs> yeah, yeah, and it's uh, it's a little rough too because uh, we we give the spotlight to tens, but Shazam uh, really pulling a whole ton of weight just throughout that entire round. Well done from Shazam, not only getting that first pick over towards that A site, but uh, of course that Hunter's Fury helps. This is a big round now, Sully, though. Sonics is starting to play around a little bit more with they their aren't... economy. Their utility may not They're be not up to They're not guaranteed for Berlin. But, uh, They're... This could still be a big opportunity for them to play but around with this 3-2 formation. they are guaranteed for champions, formation. which is, I would say, the so most important tournament anyway. So idea on where to go. It's not a super big deal. I think they're just going to work out a default. So yeah. again, typically on buying, normally where the Sova is, the majority of players are going to be in. With so much success so far in this A side, it's smart for wow. Sonics to make this stack in flicks. Wow. Able to shut down 10s right off the rip. They're not going to so retrieve that rifle for, for Dizzy, that unfortunately. Nice shot. Yeah. But it's at least an opening to kick things off. And it's weakened at least this A attack where now you don't really have that entry. You still have six double blast back and showstopper. But on the A side, it is so difficult to clear these corners with it. Oh, it's gonna start with a showstopper. Sick. Utilizing one of his satchels. Gonna utilize a nice. second to try to get a kill. It's Shazam getting the kill onto Flix. So, uh, yeah, that showstopper doesn't really matter, but instead it is going to be two kills going back and forth for both orbital teams. Strike. Sentinels still gonna be able to survive with a 2v2, but that orbital strike coming in right as Sully says, of course. Mm -hmm. Uh, <laughs> 50 Locking seconds smoke. left. It's crunchy spike still with plant. a little bit Can of utility. That orbital strike did nothing as the spike goes into the green box. This is a tough crossfire, but they do have a flank here, Sully. 
It might even, I mean, the Orbital Strike reroutes the position to maybe even a better spot for Sentinels, knowing that the flank was coming from Short and Shazam. Yeah. He's going for a flank of his own. So much heat taken right onto Dapper and it's just to allow Shazam to swing. He knows he's forced one here. Apologies. She knows she's forced one, at least into showers. But the second, it is such a difficult crossfire with Shazam no. up in heaven. Shock Dart not even going to connect. Bob, nothing she can do here except wait death. As Dapper playing with his food, nothing really <laughs> could be done. And 4 to 2 for well Sentinels. Played, well played. A little bit of a shaky execution and a shaky start with 10s going down early on. And they do find a way to recover off of that double blast back showstopper. Did they say she? Yeah, which is good because, again, that is, that is such an important uh ultimate especially nowadays Sully. i mean he got bumped up all the way up to eight old points that showstopper is basically a guaranteed kill they weren't able to get anything off of it just a little bit more space so uh, again very good job for them at least uh getting off of that and still just overwhelming with the amount of bodies that they even had on site but uh i'm sorry i messed up i actually i accidentally, I accidentally Sully, said she instead of he a little bit uh, i base it off of rotation. agents but okay. i messed up no worries here. Two man push down. Fake footsteps in the showers to maybe sell some presence in Shazam. A nice grab as well just to clear the right cubby behind the boxes. It should be a free plant here, but Whoa. Bob, okay. She's going to come up huge with at least the first 10. She's just not having it. She? Whoa, Bob. Bob. Why did someone say she? One from her and Bob is a girl. Chimes in. A Bob two is a versus girl. two. And Bob, Bob is a girl. she's picked up at least a fan. She? Six bullets okay. and we're taking the team. Look who's already here. Rotation. Look who's already here. I am sitting in wait. I am sitting right in the middle of sight, anticipating this rotation. Okay. I in such a great spot. Could be able to pop. Oh, there goes no. Dapper. Lands right in the middle of his crosshair. And now it's just Sums in a 1v2. Lands right into Ian again, but Ian can't get the kill, can't get the headshot. Oh, Bob. She has to pull this off with only two or three HP, I think, Sully. Sums, it's just a gust of wind. I had no idea. Would be able to take them into this dub, but... uh. Man, 30 seconds left. Still no spike plant. It's just a little bit of a game of cat and mouse. Bob has no clue oh where, where her goodness. opponent is. She yeah. thinks he's rotating as well. Zombie well has two stars to play with. By the time she's already made the rotation, it's too late. Like you said, a gust of wind. And Bob is a phantom. So she needs to try and close this distance and get a headshot to win out this fight. Zoms can hit any part of the body, and he's going to aim for the chest. Hey, Fifth round for now. Sentinels, but man, that was extremely <laughs> I love that close. name, Bob. Really? Yeah. <laughs> a Look, a Bob is popping close. off. Great job from Ian, though. Oh, we get a, we get a clutch yeah. out of that, of course, from earlier. I love, I love to see this. Ian, it was a great approach. Great oh, attempt. Man. The Red Bull Clutch, simply going in the hands of Zoms though. It was a 1v2 for Zoms. Yeah, well played, That's well, so well cool. played. This next round is no gonna idea. be a little bit tougher though. Oh, look at the setup again. Well, we saw look her up this real around quick. Tenzis throwing his gate crash towards the B side. And they're going to do again that same contact in the showers. See if Sick can maybe disrupt the, the hookah setup and get control while his other two teammates scour the map elsewhere. But it's a pretty heavy play from Sonics towards long. You have got both Dizzy and Bob who is just use her owl drone to try and get this information. The gate crash played to the B site doesn't look to be the most optimal, but it looks like instead the play is towards Hookah. And while Tenz has got at least the first ult toward It's Queen Bobsta on don't Twitter. Have any okay. long control. Okay. Yes, they've got Hookah, but that's the main concern. This setup, it's not the most optimal. You really Whoa. can't support anyone on site, and Tenz is gonna get the first contact, but Dizzy in a prime position to get one <gasps> kill and immediately dismiss out. Oh my god, who do you remember making a play like this? It was Tenz. That did this to Fnatic. Oh, she follows me on Twitter. That same Viper wall over towards Long. Can certainly play out time, oh, but no, the Viper wall knows. goes down. And it was Tens that got the kill. Of course it was Tens. Tens knows the play. And Dizzy goes down in a heap in such a good off angle. So instead now it's going to be Sentinels just oh, wow. bouncing right on in on site. And a little bit of Astra Util too. We haven't talked too much about the effect of the Astra pick just yet, but I'm sure we could do that a little bit later. Flicks going in, getting a kill off that nade. And a showstopper at the exact same time. Going to be able to get a kill onto Dapper. And Bob gets one wow. too. Two B2. Incredibly low HP on Plix. But Plix still gets the headshot onto Shazam. Zom's now a very possible 1v2. Let's go. Fuck. Zom's, Zom's nation in chat, Sentinels. guys. Let's Gets fucking go. Yet another Red Bull clutch. Zom's nation Red right Bull now. Clutch for Zom's. Right when go. they need him, he strikes. <laughs> I mean, both players are already such low HP, but he had perfect positioning. And the Insane. swing timing from Sonics made all of that possible. Look at this positioning, right? Nade comes in, knows where the first is, and he immediately flicks to the second.
Very well done from Zom in the 1v2. And Sonics, they're going to be kicking themselves. They know that's around they should be winning, but they can't find the victory. Sentinel's up 6 to 2, and it resets Sonics once oh more. Oh my god. Any pro uh, pro players on teams you follow? Any girl pro players? This is the taste of their own watched, medicine in all honesty. I watched Sonics, all of C9 White. They were the ones I mean, resetting Sentinels round Coeb, after no. round in the last map, and now Sonics, they're the ones in economic, wow. ooh, nice in try, economic trouble. But the pistol oh still God. works, Sully. I, I don't really know. We could call any of these Ecos inefficient. We've always seen at least like two to three kills back from these teams on Ecos. I don't think we've seen a flawless Eco round or anti-Eco round yet. Oh, I uh, this is huge. Two Ooh. kills. Oh, oh, sick. Instantly denying him the opportunity. Nade in the back as well, anticipating the cross. And Bob, she's going to swing right on through. She's been good with her share of so far, but with four players and so many angles to watch Shazam, Take the bait, and he does. He thought it was Bob that he should be worried about, but Crunchy up close what is going to find a third. This is a huge damage to Sentinels. It's not going to oh, be too no. much economically, <laughs> as they have so much credit stacked up. And yeah, they'll take the I TP out. Three plan coming into the B side, and Sentinels with their seven, most likely. Yeah, I love how much of a desperation play that was too. Crunchy well just launches in that volley, right through the wall, right into teleporter. You know, just, just in case they want to go through, they have to run into a pit of inferno. But uh, a little bit melt timed, and Sentinels was taking a couple of steps ahead. Aka, they were already stepping into the middle of teleporter when that happened another round here sully look at the old t's on sentinels all five lined up tens has been all good five. especially when using his his ultimate for reconnaissance right and now you have the opportunity to use the owl drone and dimensional drift to get info into this b site sick is going to do again his same setup into hookah boomba and then the nade to force and put players in their place there's an early ult into a site an iron He's gonna sit right in the corner. That's the exact same spot that Dapper sits there in his Viper's pit. So maybe, just maybe, they can make that read. But it's gonna clog up this entire A main position. Tens you. is actually gonna go in with the reconnaissance Happy off the dimensional themselves. drift. True, true. First, I messaged him instead, and he just though, texted though, me Sonic's back and he goes... All of this space taken up. What can you expect from them? Two players on the same side. And Tenz is no, he knows that he's forced at least the Viper oh. out of position. And Sick is again going to take this space. Love the info play, but it's going to have to come back to Sick. Sick has to get a kill here. What just happened? Did Plix just outplay Sick by satcheling on top of Green Box? 1,000 IQ. Well done. That's desperation at its finest. Two players down now for Sentinels. And this Viper's Pit is just such a roadblock. None of these players from Sen can make their way through. The spike is now isolated over well. in Bathroom. It's Ouchie. just all too tough. And now in comes Dizzy on the flank too, covering up Shazam. Zoms is now the last one remaining in a 1v5. Going to be able to get one. Still has a Cosmic Divide. Yeah, still very much a tall task though. A couple of taps here and back. Can uh, at Ethan. least give Zoms a little bit of a chance to break to apart the ego of Sonics, which hasn't exactly solidified yet. Um, but the overall theme of the round, Sully, Sonics just took a third, pretty good one. I though. asked Tyson what he yeah. what he thought as about as they, as soon as they me proposing that the to him, drift comes and he in, said he knew that Tens was just the forerunner, and he was just looking so. for information, and they couldn't expect know. it immediately after. As soon as Tens gets that info, I don't want to take that away. Come into play, a double blast pack. Huge, huge outplay from Plix of last back on top of nice Tetris. Shot. And then that orbital strike to disrupt that entrance, right? As as Sick goes in, orbital strike breaks up that offensive line. And next thing you know, Sick is in a 1v3, blast packing into the middle of a bomb site. And Sonics breaking up that offensive line will pick up the third. One casualty amassed. Apologies, two casualties amassed. And Sentinels with themselves still with a couple of credits in their bank account have just enough again to reinvest and see if they can maybe muster another round. It's seven to three. We're coming down to the last two rounds, and once more, it's Sentinels who are leaning again to this B site with an early play from Sonics down towards A short. It's gonna be sick on the front lines. There you go, sick. Consistently getting some insane entry frags. And this time it's yet another one. Look at that combo. No way <laughs> Dizzy can escape from that. Oh my. Oh my, the snake bite alongside the satchels ends up getting a big kill. Sonic Ooh, still with only two players remaining, still getting kills with only two players remaining. Let's see what Ion can try to pull off. He collides things under 2v2. Trade back from Sick, but no! Ion still gets the kill off of the swing! Out of nowhere, it's Shazam now in a 1v2. Gets tagged out, running right towards Bob. Bob gets a headshot right through the wall, and that is another run for Sonic.
Nice. I like the idea of her at least Shazam in that position. He's like, okay, I know where the Owl Drone came from. I know that my teammate 10's died into elbow. I'm just going to try and pressure the situation and maybe put myself in a better position to win the 1v1. Last but Sonics somehow are able to recover that round after Dizzy goes down to a snake fight and a nade combination. It really didn't look good, at least for Sonics in this one. Yeah, Dizzy loses his life here. And somehow, Ayn is able to muster two kills out of literally thin air. And Sonics, they will have a fourth. Now they're looking for their fit to close out this half. But right now, again, it's Sentinels who are in pretty good control. They're by maybe not echoing that same thought, but it's the last one of the half. You do what you can with the guns you've got. Standing ahead. Yeah, it's, uh, there's a couple of steps involved for Sentinels <laughs> to be able to Alice. make their way <laughs> onto these sites. And, uh, one of them could be that Guardian supremacy. making an opening. I do like that boost over towards Long. But early on, it's Sentinels taking a lot of control over towards Uka. Nobody from Sonics even playing contact over towards that area. Love that Molly gonna stop things for just a little bit. Bob right through the Nebula gonna be able to get the kill at the tens. You okay, as Kari? tens thought like uh, that he's a little bit I'm used weaker to than usual. Nothing new. This Viper's Pit, however, gonna be the opening oh, up from Uka. Crunchy in the back. Just gonna be able to take down the What the fuck? It's the Guardian going nuts. Crunchy. Oh, that double spray now got one through the smoke. Took down sick at the exact same time no it's dapper in a 1v3 and he's gonna even gonna make the rotation they don't know this exactly by the time they get there he should have a plan is he gonna double route this he might just go back in no i think instead he's gonna try and plant for for short here in this position i love this rerouting as well from from dizzy takes it back towards you all that's the exact last possession nice. you expect someone to be in but dapper mind games on mind games goes back to the b site he's got no dude sale all he's got to rely on is nothing but aim Hopefully. Maybe that one poison orb that helps. Covering up just a little bit of space. Dapper is gonna pressure. close in that space. Toxin would have to go down and Dapper. Light oh, up. Dapper wants to go! go! Holy Dapper! fuck, you're insane, Mike! Sheesh! Holy shit! Unreal! That is textbook Red Bull clutch go. stuff from Dapper. Oh Listen. God. That I was so scary when the smoke over went again. down when you there, are in guys. A disadvantage, oh, you need shit. to create an advantage for, for yourself. And Dapper, again, 500 IQ, TP that to A, so TP smart. back to B, and that poison orb literally won in the round. The one bit of utility that was left on this B site. I don't know if he had that planned in his mind. And <laughs> if he did, somebody get this guy an IQ test because he's blowing through the roof right now. Sonics, four to eight. Sentinels mustering in the final round of that half as they approach into this pistol. And Sonics. Now when the attacking side, this is where you expect this composition to shine. So much utility dump on the sites. We'll have to wait and see. When we go again, you said that util dump would have to come into play. Sentinels. At least now on that defensive side, they already started off a little bit well. There goes that one way off the Nebula. Sick. He wants to find an early nade to get any sort of Bravo. info here on short. It would be huge for Sick. Whoa! Flicks jumping in off that satchel. Going to be able to get a kill off the Sick. Still goes back. Zom's Ooh. getting two with that frenzy. Great spray down. Shazam coming up from behind. Super, super quick. Tens is right in the middle of the back, too. But it's very isolated. He was playing around the smoke, and now Shazam can play crossfire right towards oh, the middle of sight. This is actually oh, such an sucks. inopportune <laughs> sandwich that Sonics has themselves in. And Shazam just has to keep his angle, and everything can work out. Ten still towards that back line. Shazam still getting another one. Playing time. Bob has to go for the swing. And she goes down in a heap. It's Shazam with three big kills to finish off the round sentinels with the all-important pistol perfect delay as well there was a little bit of a gravel that came out from zombs towards a short as sonics up began to approach the site and it was a perfect bait they wanted sonics to walk into this stack right there were already three players in rotation one took the tp Ken was already so running you know, to the Tyson site shazam was pushed right up now. on the he's flank sick, sonics so. they walk right into the trap that is sentinels a gravel to disrupt okay. the push and that's the rest Sonic's down nine to four, similar it's not to what too we saw bad at the moment. He's on, he's almost sixty, and everyone's around. And they've spent all their credits to to every gun they could find. The They're twenty, the twenty extra ping just pistols. Can, it's gonna be a difficult one. You know, it can, it can affect for sure. I'm not trying to make excuses for him. But.
Yeah, yeah it's gonna be super hard for Sonic to even make it through this defense. Even with that isolated lurk, it could have made a little bit more noise. It's because of the vaccine. Straight shut down he has early a really on. high fever. He's been burning up. He long. didn't get a really good sleep. Double last night, nebula, sadly. or just double stars, or the word short. As we just wait up for Sonics on their Maybe approach, Dizzy yeah, over towards back. Oh, Time man. has an open shot for Tens, oh. and Plix was utilized as a bait there. That could have easily been a pick back, but Tens gets it. And now it's only Bob in a 1v5 as a classic and ends up going down flawless anti-eco. And I said it sure. earlier. Happy I birthday, Timmy. Thank you. I think there was a flawless anti-eco throughout this uh, BO3 thus far. We finally got it. There it is. Very is. end. It almost broke apart when Tens wasn't looking the right way in his showers, but thankfully he recovers just nicely. 10 to 4 for Sentinels. A full bonus round moving forward on Apologies. Sick, who had a ghost in the last round. Hope he recovers once, fast. I do too. He's going to look, I imagine, I've just been getting headaches. Showers where Sonics but Tyson's kind of just been situation. really feeling it. Not a lot of pressure towards showers. Now we know Sentinels are a team that kind of leaves showers so after the that's 10, why he hasn't, first 10 to 20 seconds. He didn't so stream yesterday. Early UCL either. coming out at least. He's I imagine, like feeling from okay for a little bit. The, um... A fake TP. Gate crash, I don't believe, is set up on A for Tens to make the fast rotation. And yeah, they're sick retreating out of showers after he gets that control and sonic's playing a very very slow default i think they're just looking for information and there's even another tp ready Ten is going back to the a site you, nice he has now a gate crash power. set up on b this is really quiet from sonic's and sentinels there's no information for them to play off of. i think he just didn't wear for the three months <laughs> no info and usually I off these defaults we see months. early util at least over towards that a site but again this is just sonic's trying to play the the most basic of defaults and potentially mm -hmm. uh, potentially the most Kinda basic people of are being mean to you yeah a little bit of a burst okay. later on that's fine it looks like that with the retake <laughs> i think this is kind of planned from sentinels right there <laughs> what am i supposed to say showers in all zone he knows Dude, showers given up and that's he what happens to walk into a. when you're He'll in this the industry game, there's still more to come yeah, sick gonna be able to take down Dizzy Dizzy wide swinging in an awkward angle, but even more awkward was Tense trying to go for a flash over towards short, but Ayn comes in at a pretty good angle. Dapper actually gets a kill off that snake bite right in the middle of sight. That's a little bit awkward. Sentinels now only have one person remaining, and what a person to leave it off to. It's Shazam now in a 1v2, but goes down to Ayn and yet another awkward off angle. But it's gonna be Wasting those off angles that are gonna to win you me? some rounds. Bob and Ayn combined. Are you supposed to show to how shit Sonic's your throw. life is? So, keep hating. I don't really oh, give a fuck. Again, tens is waste your time. Like, not even looking towards showers. This time it actually does. I'm out here Sonic thriving. Kill, and that was what won them around essentially, right? It allows fuck. Ian to creep out from showers, play that light angle for the, where Shazam walks Thanks out. Thanks for from. the views and the ad a revenue. A misplay, I'd say for tens, or maybe a miscommunication, right? They realized they should have realized <sighs> they gave up showers, and there could be that player lurking. And I think. With the execution on A, you should expect them to have showers control. This time, Dapper I mean, is going to throw down that Viper wall to adjust for that miscommunication. <laughs> Make sure they at least have some I did when I first started. checking it, he immediately backs away. A nice Al drone for Shazam after realizing showers is clear. That's he wants so to see funny. where the players are, and he's going to catch uh -oh. at least the back of one, and that's Plix. That, they know that's their main entry, and Tenz is going to push forward as well with the gate crash already ready towards that A site. And there you go. Tenz immediately backing on out. Immediately getting that TP back. <laughs> Free money, a exactly, a Alan. Very dangerous peek over towards <laughs> the fun, Long fun B, fact. That's the point of it. Uh, Alan, Chris, and I were actually talking last night, and, and we were just talking about back, people and how B. I don't really give a, a shit anymore. Hold for now, Sully. So yeah, there are two stars already set up. One's kind of funny be a that Bravo. I'm One should be a smoke, maybe even a, a Nova Pulse. But it looks like yeah, smoke goes out towards B Long. Recumble <laughs> to get even more information. There is so much intel that this is going to be a B hit, but they're not convinced. They are not convinced at all. I think the Viper Wall has gone up on the A side and it's both really like rotations. It. One at least has gone back Can't nearly a hit. second. Tens has got a gate crash ready right in the me. back of defender spawn just in just case. And now come chest. Sonics yeah, ready I, to barrel their way into he, the site. And it's a weakened defense set up here by Sentinels. Flex was second thinking it, just trying to get a little bit better of an angle. Finally in the middle of sight, but it's going to be the Hunter's Fury taking him down. Som's helping out so too. Low. What a combo in the middle of sight, but Sentinels only able to get two out of that interaction. Dapper with a big TP. Nice. Finally goes for the wide swing and takes down Ion. All right. Tough to say the least, and it's 10 seconds left with a great crossfire from Sentinels. Nice. They can surely well pull it off. If they can all go for the wide swing, and indeed they do. Shazam and Dapper hold sock. down the <laughs> angles. They don't allow that spike to even get close to the middle of Tin Can, and that's the round.
Are you adding people in Discord? Very, I'm not. Very powerful. The way Tenz is using his Yoyo right now. Yes, he's not having the and same impact that maybe we expect so. from him on, on like Arena. He's able to play so many rotations, right? They were like Mandy for the two months. three times when he used either fake footsteps to try and sell a push or try and sell a teleport. And then he uses the gate crash and element of surprise is essentially what it is. You don't know exactly how many players are on a site because of Tenzin's Yoru, right? It causes so much uncertainty and Sentinels are looking good. Three players again stacked to say site. Eight crash set up for Tenzin in the back lines of A. Right behind no. Sonic's is Viper. Essentially being up a fake TP into the B site. So maybe he's telling again that there's pressure his towards utility. B and he's taking that well. TP. But I think at this point Sonic's should be expecting it. Five players lined up. A Hunter's Fury to queue it up. And that's what's going to be the initiator. Bob making space. Tie. Great delay. Perfect. And just a little bit too. And there you nice. go. Like you said, Sully, amazing delay. It's the Viper wall alongside the bite. And there's no way anybody can get any sort of just wild trade. Eh, wild trade. Just in that one spot. So lots of options covered at the moment. And Short is currently.